happy because basically today is the day that I am going to ask out my crush. Or maybe I should ask him out tomorrow? <sighs> I don't know. Basically, I've had a crush on him for years and now, literally years, so long. And I've just never had the courage to ask him out because it's like, what if he says no, you know? It's going to be so awkward and that would just be like really weird. So I just don't know what to do. Like, do I ask him out? Do I not? I mean, what happens if he says yes? What happens if he says no? It could just end so badly, which is why I'm just afraid. Um, you know what? Why don't I ask my best friend about this? Because she always has a tons of advice. I think right now she's sitting by the grumpy house. So I think I'm just going to go over there. Collect some diamonds on the way, of course. Because who doesn't need diamonds? <laughs> okay, here we go. It is just this way. And I think I see her. Um, hey, how you doing, girl? Are you doing good? Oh, hi. How you doing? Come see chats and let's talk about like you know live boys all of that juicy info <laughs> yes of course we gotta spill the tea <laughs> um okay basically um you know how i told you did i tell you actually um basically i have a crush on a guy and i don't know if i should ask him out or not because it's like what well, if he says no it would just be really awkward so I kind of wanted your advice, you know, like, do I ask him out or do I not? Like, what do I do? Girl, are you serious? Of course you've got to ask him out, yes! Trust me, he will say yes, like, you are an amazing person. Also, I kind of didn't want to tell you this, but basically, I have a crush on a guy as well. So, what if we both asked him out today? Like, why mention that? like a really good idea <laughs> okay yes we are going to do this i will ask him out fingers crossed he will say yes that would literally be the best thing ever and then we could go on a double date maybe we could go to like a restaurant or something it would be so fun or maybe we could go to the cafe at Ra hi yes yes okay we have got to do this this will literally be the coolest thing ever <laughs> Well, I guess I'm going to ask him out now and I'll see you later. Bye. Oh my gosh. What did I say? She has the best advice ever. And now I feel reassurance from her that, you know, this is going to work out. Hopefully he will say yes and then we can go on a double date. Like, imagine that. That would literally be so cool. Me, my best friend, and our crushes. Yes, I'm so in for that. So I guess now I think I just got to go and call him, haven't I? And um, ask him to meet up with me by here. <laughs> and then I'll ask him the big question, will he go on a date with me? And then I'll say like we should meet at the cafe at some sort of time. I don't know when. <laughs> we'll just come up with something. But anyways, I am going to call him now. Um, hello? Who is this? Um, what is it that you want to talk about? Um, hello? Who is this? I don't have your number saved. Why are you calling me? Oh, hi. It's Melody from school, you know. Um, yeah, I got your number from someone else. But, um, anyways, um, basically, I was going to ask if you could meet me by the fountain, like, now? If you're free, I mean, like, no pressure, of course, but, like, you know, if you're free, could you come to the fountain? Because there's something I want to ask you, and, like, I can't ask her over the phone. Oh, yeah, of course. I'm actually, like, really near that, so I'll come right now. Okay, see you soon. Ooh, well, that was interesting. It looks like Melody wants to talk to me, and I don't really know what that's about, but it seems like it's really important. Ooh, what if she's going to ask me out on a date? That would be so cool. Although... Although Melody's best friend already asked me out on a date and I said yes. But then at the same time, I like Melody more. Like, I've had a crush on her for ages, but I never thought she'd like me, which is why I said yes to Melody's best friend. 
Um, you know what? I'm gonna figure that out later. I'm just gonna go and find Melody and talk to her. Oh, hey, Adam! Oh my gosh, it's so nice to see you. Um, yeah, basically, um, this is something I've been wanting to ask for ages. Okay, I can't screw it up. Um, basically, I was wondering if you'd like to go on a date with me? Please say yes, please say yes, please say yes. Oh gosh, this is going to be so embarrassing if he says no. Oh, of course. I mean, why not? I mean, um, how do I say this? I've always kind of liked you too, you know? It's just that I kind of thought that you had made the move and then you didn't, so I thought you didn't like me. But yeah, I would be so happy to go on a date with you. I mean, when would you like to go? Oh, well, I was kind of planning that it could be like a double day, me and you, and then my best friend, you know, Susan, and then her boyfriend, and then her crush as well. So yeah, I don't really know the time yet. I'll have to text her and ask. You know what, I'll text her right now, and I will be right back, okay? Like, literally, like, two seconds. <laughs> oh my gosh, she said yes, she said yes! we get another double date i'm so so happy okay i am going to text susan right now and then we are going to agree on what time to have a double date i mean i don't know if she's asked her crush out yet but i guess i'm going to find out oh no not a double date um, um what can i do i mean she seems so intent on it there's no way i could just be like no no we can't go on a double date together or something um, what can I do? Oh no, I messed this up. Now both of them are going to hate me and I'm not going to have either of them. Um, well, there's nothing I can do, is there? I mean, unless I text Susan and I go and tell her, like, hey, I'm sorry, but we're not going on the date anymore. But that will crush Susan's heart and then Susan will tell Melody and then what if Melody finds out? And then she'll hate me again. Oh my gosh, it seems like there's no good way out of this. I'm just going to have to play off and just hope something good happens. Oh, and um, hey, I'm back. Yeah, basically, I got it all sorted out with Susan. Basically, would you be free at 7 a.m.? I mean, like, yeah, I know it's not really a dinner. It's more like a breakfast, but, like, the cafe's only really open in the mornings. It's not really open in the evening. And trust me, the Rare High Cafe is literally the best. You also want to try it. <laughs> so, yeah, are you free so we can go on the double date? Um, yeah, of course I'm free. I mean, okay, that's on the right time. So, I'll make sure I'll be there. Anyways, I guess I'll see you soon. Bye. Oh, gosh, what have I done? I should have just... I, sh I should have said no. I should have said I was busy. I should have said I was busy. Okay, um, I've screwed up. I've screwed up. Um, there's nothing I can do. I'm just gonna have to wait. I guess I just hope something good happens. I've said that too many times. Nothing good is going to happen. Because I have screwed this up for myself so badly. I should have just... Uh, made a better choice or something i don't know but i guess it's too late now i already agreed so i'm gonna have to turn up there and then they're both going to find out and be really mad at me but there's nothing i can do anymore i will okay so i've just arrived and it is time for the double date so i guess i'm just gonna sit there and you know wait for susan to come and wait for for Adam to come. This is going to be the coolest thing ever. And hey, Susan, I see you've already arrived and I cannot wait for my date Adam to arrive. It's going to be so good. Um, Adam? What do you mean? My date is called Adam. Wait, and there's two Adams. No, no. There's only one Adam that we know, right? Wait, I'm so confused. What do you mean by Adam? Wait, Wait, that's Adam right now! My Adam! Wait, so is that my Adam and your Adam a different Adam? I'm here for the date, you know? How are you doing? Are you doing good? Is everything fine, you know? Um, why is she saying that she's your Adam when I asked you on a date and you said yes? Can you explain what's going on? Because it seems like both of us have the same date when you're meant to be my date, not hers. 
Like, what? Did you want both of us out in a day? At the same time? Like, what? M just explain yourself. Fine. So, basically, I've always had a crush on you, Melody. Like, I wasn't lying about that at all. But I thought you'd never say yes. So, when Susan asked me out on a day, I was like, yeah, sure. But then, not long after, you asked me out on a day, and I just didn't know what to say. Since I'd already agreed with Susan, but, like... I had a crush on you, so I just didn't know what to do and I thought it would be fine or something. No, it's not fine. And you know what? I don't want to date a person like you, but it's good to to be like, I don't even know, two-timing me with my best friend? Like, how could you do that? No way am I going on a date with you. No thanks. I'd rather be alone. So bye. Let's go, Susan. <laughs> So that is the end of the video and I really enjoyed recording that. Oh my gosh, you do not two time people, you know. If you're with someone, you're with someone. If you agree to go with someone on a date, you do not agree to go on a date with someone else. <laughs> but anyways, make sure you ring the bell to be notified. Do you like and subscribe and thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed. Bye.